Yeah, what up? Welcome back to another video. We haven't done a sit down video in the garage for a little while right now, but I wanted to show you guys something. We got my brand new riding boots right here. These are from Harley Davidson. Really, really nice. I've been wearing them for the past few weeks, and let me tell you, really, well, let me not tell you yet. And before somebody writes down in the comments, oh, well, they were give it to him. He's supposed to be saying good stuff about them. No, they, they weren't. I bought them with my hard-earned cash. Now, the reason why I wanted to make this video is because we all know how hard it is to find a good pair of riding boots, riding shoes, riding sneakers, whatever it is you ride with, it's, it's pretty hard to find something that's gonna check all the boxes for you. And that's what this boot right here does. Now, looking at it from afar, you're gonna be like, oh, I kinda don't like it. At first, when I saw them, I was like, uh. Oh. Then when I got real close to them, I held them in my hand, I'm like, let me just try them on. I totally fell in love with them. Now, the reason why it checks all the boxes off for me is because of these reasons right here. Boom, style. I think the boot looks really, really, really nice. In the past few times that I've been wearing them, I did get a lot of great compliments on them. They look really, really nice on. Now, number two, comfort is something we all look into when we're looking in, into riding boots um, or any, any shoes in general. Um, these are really, really comfortable. They, I don't know what they have inside, but it, it, it feels like it has some type of gel pad inside. It, it feels like I'm walking on Nike Air Maxes, th to be honest. So really, really comfortable on the sole, on the heel of your foot as well. Now, there was one last thing that I really, really was prioritizing when I was getting these new riding boots, and that was that it was waterproof these are waterproof right here my last boots that i had weren't and i th that's what i really hated and that's why i ended up buying a new pair it's because i i needed to uh, i was tired of coming home with my feet wet now i'm not the type of rider that i go out when it's raining if it's raining i'm like ah, I'm, you know what i'm just gonna chill inside but if i'm out there and i get caught in the rain it is what it is and i get caught in the rain a lot and i really got tired of coming home with soaky socks soaky ass boots and it just it just i hate that feeling so i wanted something that was going to be waterproof so this right here does it for me have i got caught in the rain with these yet no so i will definitely let you guys know in in the next few weeks on how that works and how that went now there's another little factor about this boot that i really like as well it gives me some height so you guys know i'm not i'm not too tall i'm more on the shorter end i'm five seven so this boot right here gives me a nice height um on the heel and then on the platform as well so being that i'm not such a tall rider i, I want to feel comfortable i want to wear a boot that i'm able to feel comfortable and confident and know that i'm gonna just place my foot down flat foot that bike and especially on those rainy 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 days on those slick roads and talking about that slick roads the grip on these boots are great. They have a tremendous amount of grip, and I th that's something that I always look for. So, wanted to put a pair of shoes on when you're riding, and you know, you, you put your foot down the wrong way, the bike starts tilting over. Nah, 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 nah. No, not with these. So, amazing grip, gives me height, they're waterproof. Oh, we didn't even mention that they're super, super high as well. So, I'll show you guys how they look on right now. I think, I mean, looking at the boot like this right now, you might look, I'm, even me, I'm like, eh, I kind of don't like it. But once you put the pants over it and then just the bottom shows, that's where it's like, oh, shoot. Like, th those boot look sick. So let me put these on and I shall model them for you. It's funny because when I bought them um, and I showed them to a few of my friends, I actually bought them at Bike Night at Bergen, and they were like, Ugh, like you like those, you like those? I'm like, yeah, they're dope, dude. Just, they're, they're cool. Um, yeah, and then we went out for a ride or two, and everyone was like, oh, dude, like, are, those boots look good. Are those the same ones you got? I'm like, yeah. Yeah, they, they just look different when, when the pants cover the top of the boot, man. Now, as you can see, once you put them on, they look really, really, really nice on. Really like the way they look. I like the way they feel. I don't know what else to tell you. I like them. I think they look great. I can't wait to put more miles on them. 
I especially was looking for a pair of waterproof boots now for my ride that I'm going to be taking from New Jersey out to Milwaukee for homecoming in Milwaukee. That is going to be a crazy, crazy event. Guys, if you still haven't gotten your tickets, go ahead. I'm going to be looking at that link down below in the bio box as well. But I went last year. I had a great time. Um, I'm really... Not for nothing, but I'm really looking forward to go back to the Harley Davidson Museum again. I, I went twice last year in the four or five days I was there and that still wasn't enough. So I'm actually very eager to go back this time, especially because we're heading out there with a group of friends and some of them haven't gone there yet. So I kind of want to see their faces. I want to I want to be there for their experience. There's going to be concerts, a ton of artists are coming, a ton of vendors. Come out with your friends. I'm going to be there with the Jersey crew. And last but not least, guys, we got the YouTube meet and greet where me and a bunch of other content creators are going to be there hanging out at Veterans Park. So you don't want to miss that as well. All of us in one place, your favorite content creators on YouTube. I might not be your favorite, but you could just come and say hi to your favorite content creator there. It's going to be epic. It's going to be history. Homecoming has only been around. Well, this is going to be its second year around. It's already one of the biggest rallies in the whole country. So don't miss out on history, man. But yeah, that ride out to Milwaukee is when I'm really going to really try these out and put them to the actual test. If it rains, it rains. I'll let you guys know how they're doing that. Um, but yeah. Even, oh, I forgot to mention, but even durability, because I've been wearing them for the past few weeks. I've been on the bike a lot, and durability, I, I haven't seen a scratch on them, and I'm here shifting and doing this and doing that. Um, the leather on them feels great. Durability feels awesome. They feel comfortable. I'm telling you, it's like wearing a pair of Nike Air Maxes, to be honest, and yeah. Cool stuff coming from the Harley Davidson company. Cool and stylish at that. Anyways, I like these boots. Let me know what you think. Drop your thoughts in the comments down below. And if you'll be in Milwaukee, I will be seeing you there. Like always, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Share this video with your friends. And like always, guys, let the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.